Hello Kemper friends, uh, this is the Adria Twin Supreme 600 SPB in Expedition Grey on BFT Goodrich Altera tires. Um, very interesting color, I really like it and um, it looks like silver grayish and it's not definitely not white. This car is six meters long, two meters and five wide, and uh, total height of two meters fifty nine. Beautiful car. I'll give you a brief overview on the outside. Look at these tires, they really look beautiful. Very nice. The inside is a good mix of uh, glossy white, dark grey and the seats also have a, a very beautiful color scheme of grey and uh, light grey. This is leather and cloth and then we have on the back, show you around, the backup camera and the brake light parking sensors in the bumpers and then on this side we have the usual amenities like window for the bathroom which is not normal um, cassette door cassette toilet door Truma vent energy access and this color looks really nice and I will get a few more photos of the wild nature where this car is parked in the woods. So I will blend that into the video later on. Let's go inside. So first look inside with the kitchen block in the door as usual with camper vans. You can see the additional rail for the table so you can actually take that table outside and put it on this connected to the kitchen block and then you have an outside table uh, there is a, a light above the door which moves with the door off center of the entrance and then we have the integrated box screen which blocks the the table mount but you have to die one death so you either are free from bugs or you have the table outside and you have enough storage in the garage to get an extra table a foldable, foldable table um, and then on this side we have the extension of the working space we have two little shelf units which you can use either for shoes or maps or books and then on this side we have two seats with two seat belts the table contains also cup holders and a uh, little storage compartment now I'm going back in the car and give you a full overview of the car and you can see it's light and airy with this massive amount of glass in the roof. We have a little compartment here which is a decent amount of storage for the passenger side. Same thing but bigger on the driver's seat side and full turnaround of compartment here. Behind that white cover is the TV mount which you can then mount here on this wall. And you can see the difference between last year and this year is the difference of the uh, surface. This one is glossy. The new ones are coming with matte white. That is a um, nine gear automatic shift box or gearbox 
and there you can see the the nice color scheme on the seats entertainment system navigation hands-free turn around we have a 230 volt up here antenna and USB uh, touch reading lights and on this side we have the kitchen block which is the typical camper van block with two stove burners and the integrated sink which I personally really like because it makes cleaning so much easier just wipe it off into the sink and off you go there's also a little shelf up here and we have another 230 volt outlet over here then we have the uh, third foot absorber fridge with uh, fairly big bottle holders in the door as well as a deep freezer compartment here and that is definitely enough storage for two people to travel below the fridge we have the wardrobe with a hanger integrated Let me open that up show you a bit inside so you see the hanger and that is fairly long to hold your suits shirts skirts everything you want to pack in and now going back to the kitchen we have three massive drawers which are really big and hold a lot of stuff soft clothes all of th all three of them are same size Uh, another shelf up here another cupboard also quite big and then we have the bathroom on the other side here's the already mentioned window with a little cupboard above to store your yeah bathroom stuff then we have a, a small shelf below the window, the turnable toilet, a beautiful sink with a nice faucet, and uh, then we have the shower head above the movable wall, which then, if once flipped around, gives you a very decent shower compartment and what I like about it is this area here above the uh, sink of the other side because it gives you extra room for the shoulders during the shower and once you're finished showering you just dry off the walls with your towel and then close it back and it's hold hold it magnetically to the wall and then you have a, a small vent in the ceiling to suck off the wet air and a towel or clothing dryer hanger and then you can actually close that off with that door and then we come back to the bedroom area yay so you can see we have a total of six cupboards above the bed and they're fairly big as well we open this one for example that is okay decent amount and you have six of those that's good you have a, a little sky roof 
40 by 40 hickey and two windows in the rear and then in each side of the doors you have extra shelves we have reading lights above the headrest light switches and there is the rail system from Adria which allows you to plug in also a 5 volt USB port beneath the bed you have another cupboard here and two small storage compartments on this side um, this is fairly dark and I probably can turn on my light let's see we can do that no I'm sorry not yet but I will show you the loading cargo capacity and, and area from the rear when I open the rear doors so let's move out this is the view from the rear so you can see there's a lot of room for two people to sleep in and now when we turn that down you can see the garage there's actually a, a separation uh, door which allows you to close the garage off from the living area here we have the storage compartments there's this other cupboard and here's the the gas compartment and it actually houses two 11 kilo bottles but and that's the compromise again for a camper van you have to fiddle the bottles behind each other which gives it a little place of a burden and that is at least yeah some work to do so a dual control might be a good accessory and uh, in this case it's a mono control uh, friends of mine have a similar twin from tw um, 2017 and they integrated a aftermarket gas tank yeah that's the view of this beautiful twin supreme 600 SPX um, fantastic th car with less than 600 uh, 600 centimeters six meters perfect for uh, parking in town so that is beautiful so please give me a like if you like the video subscribe and hit the bell if you don't want to miss new content thank you very much and have a pleasant day